Hello everyone, my name is Lil Jacob Gaming. Happy Halloween. Um, today I'm going to be playing more of the Escapist 2. So, the map that we're going to do today, since Halloween is today, <laughs> um, we're going to be playing Wicked Ward, and we're going to do it the single player way. So, let's begin. Spooky Jacob. And we'll skip this because. Again, you can watch um, the original intro in my um, original. Is it? Yeah, original series. So, this escape is really easy. Um, all you gotta do is just follow the quests. Um, there's one person in the game who will give you quests. It was called like My Zombie or something. So, I just gotta find it real quick. Oh, here we go. Crime wave. So, first I need to get the zombie hand and returned it to him. Already made it to roll call. Kind of panicked there for a second. I haven't played this game in a really long time because I've been mostly playing um, Roblox Entry Point, and it's a pretty fun game. Right now I'm doing the Halloween hit list, and I've completed all of them so far. So, yay! So if you've never played um, Entry Point, um, it's basically this game we gotta do secret missions and all the other stuff. And um, for Halloween, they're doing a Halloween hit list where you have to try and find pumpkins around the map. Wait. Okay. I gotta go around. We have to find pumpkins all around. And... Um, if you shoot them, then you'll probably get, like, prizes. Um, so if you get five pumpkins... Yeah, there we go. Okay. So if you get five pumpkins, you'll get, like, shades. And then I want to say it's either eight or nine that you get shades to. And then 13 is a secret. It's pretty cool. Is there any drops? No. Okay, well... I don't need money anyways. You know, I think we should just guard ourselves with a weapon first. I'm gonna check Crime Wave's desk. Crime Wave's right there. Ooh. So, I, he needs, he needs, um, I think it's like a flower pin. I want to say, I forgot what it was. <laughs> That's how long I haven't played this game. I've also been, I've also been playing, um, Papa's, uh, pop, the Papa games, where it's like Papa's Freezeria, Papa's Cupcakeria, you know, all their stuff. The one that I'm trying, and it's really good, um, is Papa's Scooperia, and I really love it. So it basically goes in with Papa's Cupcakeria, um, I can't think of any others. Donutria is okay. Um, some are like, yay, some are like, eh. And we're like, no, I can't do it. Um, but overall, I really like the game. Oh, wait, that was dude. Wait, hold on. If I recall to my, um, the very first episode of this, was dude the one who beat me up? And then I, like, raged or something? I want to say dude was the one who beat me up. Or is it somebody else? Nah, I think it was dude. I recognize that mohawk. The first thing that I always do is the one that I just forgot right now. Jeez, I need to catch up with my escapist stuff. At least I remember that I can do this. It's just I can't do it fast enough because I forgot how to. Oh, there we go. I'm gonna drop off everything. Maybe not. I'm just not gonna make it over there. Yeah, it's only a half star. Don't worry. Crime wave. Here you go. There you go. Okay. Next one. Get the axe. Get the head. <laughs> get the axe head. Get the tool handle. Get the roll of duct tape. Okay. Oh, wait. It's in my desk. Wow. Okay, I'll put the stake in there for now because reasons. So, I think for this, 
Oh, oh wait, okay, wait. What? Was I supposed to give it to him? Oh, I'm supposed to beat him up with the axe! Oh, well, he's already been beaten up. Um, okay, I want to see this job that's open. There we go. Trick or treat job. Yes. So, what this job is, is all you do is just hand out, like, gifts. It's basically trick or treating. If you haven't seen the first episode, I don't know why I'm explaining it. Sorry. Um, here, you can have this. I feel like that would really hurt. I mean, it's an axe. Of course it would hurt. I mean, unless if I just whack him with the side of my axe, he should be okay. Okay, crime wave, what's next? Get book from a desk. Oh, dang it. I forgot about this one. So, there's a book under here, and you need a red key card to get in. So I this is this is where you need to get the guard outfit from. Dang it, I thought this would be quick. Echoes move out of my way. Otherwise, you're gonna get the axe. Either the side of your either the side of the axe or the front of the axe to your face. Oh shoot. Don't you dare. Oh, what? Why am I f Oh my gosh. Yeet! Well, that was quick. Quick and easy. I can just take this. Do they have- Oh, I didn't check. Um, is there any guards up here? Okay, no. Well, I can study for a little bit. Oh, I forgot about the vents. Oh, I totally forgot about that. I actually did. So I just need to find the guard with the red key card. Not key card. Ah, uh, um, key. Yeah, just key. It's not key card. Okay. Don't you dare bring up. What is it? I forgot what it's called. Good. I got some of this. So I gotta find a lighter. I think I do have a lighter. Yeah. Okay. And the next day we can probably like find a guard and knock them out. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Good. Put my armor in here. Oh wait. I don't know why I'm saying armor. I'm going back to Terraria. I keep on going back to things. Like, oh my gosh. Wait, why do I see dogs? Oh, what the heck? Oh, were they not in their cells at the right timing? Oh my gosh. You know what? I don't know why. They don't put them in solitary confinement. They're like, solitary confinement for you. And then they don't. They put them in the nurse instead. But they put me in solitary confinement. Okay. So he has cyan key card. I need red. Sorry. Cyan key. Yes, cyan key. Not the key card. Okay, so it's breakfast time. I'm gonna head over here. And just... Yeah, I'm gonna head this way because no way I'm going through those detectors ever again. Okay, still haven't found duct tape. I think I might buy it off of somebody. So I might do that because I'm finding no luck with duct tape. So let me go do my job and then let me go find the officer. Why do I have two bags? Um... How did I drop again? I drop things. Crap. There we go. Okay, I don't know why I got two. I didn't mean to. It just gave me two. Are you selling duct tape? No. Oh, nuts. Oh 
my egg. My, I don't know why I said my egg. I meant to say my leg. <laughs> what just came out is egg. Hey, dude. Do you have any stuff? <gasps> I forgive you, dude. For the last time when you beat me up. I think it was him. I'm not really sure it was him. But I'm blaming it on him. I need to get my, um, whatever it's called. My molten plastic. I almost said molten pickaxe. That's Terraria. I'm gonna head over here. I'm gonna head upstairs. Set off the metal detector. Fight with an officer. Probably in the shower, maybe. I don't know. That sounded like a weird sentence, but, um, yeah. No plan. Perfect! There you go. Oh, wait, oops. Oh, perfect. I chose the right one. Oh my gosh. Oh, oh. I'm fine if I walk out and, like, the guards are like, I'm gonna follow you because I'm a stalker. I'm fine with that. Okay, I brought the cat with me. She kept on yelling outside the door, so I brought her in. Oh, I'll make you a little good kitty witty. Okay. I'm gonna put this in here. And just pretend like a normal one. There you go. Okay, there's somebody in here. Don't mind me. Please don't. Getting med kits too, because I want med kits. So now we have the book, and we shall now give it over to whatever his name is. Um, so I'm gonna put the stuff in here real quick. Uh, I, the book can stay. I'll just stay as a guard because, me. Yeah. And maybe I'll bring out my axe because, we. And maybe just put this in here because, we. I'm just not rubbing her back, and she's all like rubbing all over my legs. Oh no! Of course! Okay, it's roll call. I can give it to him. Stop. Stop! Okay, I'm gonna wait for him to- Oh wait, no, he's coming over here. Hey, let me give you it. <gasps> Thank you! Okay, get the tool handle, get the sheet of metal, get the roll of duct tape. Okay, I think this is the last quest, and then he should be able to give me something. He should be able to give me the key, and then I can use that key to head over to the coffin area. So once you've completed, um, once you've completed the quest, you'll have to head over to an area where there's a coffin, and that's how you're gonna escape. I don't know why you need a flimsy shovel. Get a more better shovel. There you go. Okay, I think he gave. Oh wait, no, I need to do one more. One more. Get the knuckle duster, get the energy module. Okay, sorry, one more. And then after that. What? Okay, you did that on purpose. Are you kidding me? Oh my gosh! He just started over. Well, I'll be back, ladies and gentlemen, because apparently this dude wanted to start it all over. Okay, so I finally got the secret passage key. So once you get the secret passage key, you want to head over to here, and there should be a room where a coffin is, and that's where you escape. Ugh, finally. What have we here? Must have missed one. <laughs> now then. Well, what do you know? The keyhole. Ah! Hello? Oh! <laughs> Maniac!
did that person even see me? Like, poke my head out? They're like, ah, oh, sorry! <sighs> so there you go. Thank you guys for watching this video. Please leave a like or comment if you also want to. Please subscribe. Next time, I will see you later. Bye!